お前らとここで会えてよかった何<笑>ハロー guys、in this video we are becoming b l u n o and Lark's fruits。Therefore, we need to eat or equip a fruit similar to b l u n o s devil fruit。In this shop menu, we can buy the portal fruit formerly known as the door fruit。Is a legendary natural type Blax root that costs 1,900,000 belly or 2,000 Robux. Oh no! Now that we have equipped the fruit, let's showcase its first move. This ability called the Portal Dash or Z move. Alright, the next thing to do is to level up mastery. To unlock all its abilities. Okay, for the second part of this video, we are going to unlock Shark Race V4. You might notice that I have this water body in bottom DUI. This is the version 3 of the Shark Race I obtained. Now, let's continue our journey to unlock Shark Race V4. Alright, we must be sailing a boat to get a Mirage Island to spawn. But before we get to unlock V4, I want also to get the Sanguine Art. We need a Leviathan Heart, that's why we are killing this raid boss. Leviathan heart must brought to the Tiki outpost. Everyone who participated in the raid gets a Leviathan heart in their infantry. I'm giving this player a Buddha, in return he'll spawn Dark Bird. I want the Dark Fragments, which can be obtained by defeating Dark Bird. Anyone who at least did 10% damage will get the rewards. We need to get 20 demonic roots. 
This is one of the requirements in order to purchase Sanguine Art. We now have 20 Demonic Wisp. Now, let's head to Shafi. It costs 5 million belly and 5,000 fragments. Once done, you've obtained Sanguine Armor. This is the first fighting style to have a life-stealing move. Okay, we found a Mirage Island, but it's really dark in here. This is one of the hardest part to obtain Grace V4. Finding the blue gear is hard, so I came up with the idea of getting a Kitsune mask first. I got lucky. This mask gives plus 50% enhanced vision and arc seas. Okay, we are back in the Mirage Island. We are looking at the moon, in first person, for about 10 to 15 seconds. Alright, we resonated the moon again. Now, let's hurry to find the blue gear. Look, what I found. Finally, after so many tries. Does the mask really help? Anyways, let's continue our journey. We are now on the first stage of Race Awakening. This can be done with 3 or more players with different races each. This is our first trial. Finally, we have now obtained the Shark Race V4 Awakening. But we are not done yet, we still need to unlock and upgrade our skills or passives. We are now on the second stage of Race Awakening. This is a second trial. we can obtain the Whirlpool passive. This time we have a Whirlpool particle effect. This skill will affect on enemies, slowing their speed. We are now on the third stage of Race Awakening. We are now on third trial.
and obtained the Leviathan's armor passive. Now, our transformation looks cool. We can gain a water shield which regenerates by dealing damage. We are now on 4th stage, and this stage costs a total of 6750 fragments. This stage has 3 training sessions. We are now on 5th stage, and this is our final trial. This stage costs a total of 17,500 fragments. We have now completed all upgrades. We have now full maximum transformation. Now, let's showcase Sanguine Art. And now, the portal breaks. Alright guys, that's all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next one.